Hi guys, welcome to Just One Watch. On this channel, my aim is to bring you budget watches which uh, look good and hopefully work good. Um, this one I've already opened, you can see, it's well packed. I'm not exactly sure exactly what this is, I've got a couple of watches to go through, so I'm not exactly sure which one we have here. So we'll find out. So it's well wrapped and double wrapped. comes in this standard sort of buy on your own gift box. Okay, let's see what we've got inside. We have a little tool for uh, resizing the strap. Quite handy. Let's see if it looks any good maybe. Okay, and a little pill, a battery, and a watch. Okay, again, it's just a mobile lamp and plastic. And there we go. Now, I don't know what this watch is. This is you can see it there. This is a sort of uh, Omega Seamaster homage. Yeah, by I think it's Bin Bond. Pretty sure that's how you spell the name, Bin Bond. Um, there's a good weight to this watch. I can tell you that. It is pretty much covered in plastic. All over. <coughs> Sorry. So let me get the plastic off of this thing. Let me get the glass going first. There you go. So what on the back? You have the name and bond. You can see how it's very, very faint. Um, wait. Bracelet itself actually feels very, very nice. That looks at the top there. But, yeah, nice. Let me get the plastic off it. And the face is uh, a very nice. And you can see that. Yeah. And it is ticking away, so. It's not a screw down crown. Feels a bit light to the touch. I mean, yeah, that's okay. Um, the bezel is a little bit, yeah. There's a little bit of play on there, you can see. But, uh, Lines up okay. Yeah. And it feels okay. I and mean, it's easy enough to grip, it's light enough. Um, this is a healing escape valve. But, uh, yeah, so let's get some sizes from it. It's a nice looking watch, and as I say, it's a bit of weight to it. So, size wise, okay. So, crown, I'm getting 44. Yeah, 44, 43.8, yeah. And auto log 51.4 and thickness, there we go, thickness 12.5, yeah. Um, so yeah, that's a pin bond. As I say, it's a, an Omega C Master uh, homage watch. It feels quite heavy um, and it looks really nice. So I'll get all the plastic off it that's on it. On the strap here. I'll get all the plastic off it and I'll get it on wrist. See what it looks like. Yeah?
Okay guys, so here we have the pin bond Omega Seamaster homage. Um, as you can see, on wrist, it's, it's very nice on wrist, it's shaped very well. It fits my six and three quarter inch wrist very well. You'll see also what the strap is huge. Yeah. So for guys with bigger wrists, you easily get this one. Yeah, not a problem. I wouldn't have to take off maybe three, four lengths. Yeah. So yeah. I'll get that adjusted and we'll uh, give it a wear. But um, as I say, this this watch I think was about four hundred baht. So that's about twelve dollars. And that was with delivery. Yeah. So that's including delivery. Twelve dollars delivered. Yeah. And it really is a nice looking watch. And it feels substantial on the wrist as well. I just see it it's angled such that it's shaped such that it just fits snugly on my six and three quarter inch wrist. Okay guys, that's been one. I would highly recommend this um, on first impressions. It really is nice. The bezel is a little bit of play in it, but uh, it feels nice enough. Okay, well, thanks guys. If you haven't already done so, please uh, subscribe. And uh, as always, uh, if you have any comments, please leave them in the comment section below. Okay, thank you. Okay guys, so sized up and on wrist and it feels really, really good, really good, a really nice watch. And I actually had to take off five links to fit my six and three quarter inch wrist. So, yeah, there you go, the bin bond, Seamaster homage.